What is up, everybody? Everybody who's watching the replay, thank you guys so much. Um, what is happening, guys? This lighting looks a lot better. It really does. Are you watching it? Did we get the notification? Yeah, I did. What's going on, guys? I got one like on here already, so 20 seconds in. I can take I'll take that. So how are we doing today? Let's see some comments rolling. Yo, Night of Ren, what's happening? Hugs not drugs. Good to see you always in the live stream. Jonathan Mertz. Kenobi said, yo, that's me. Thank you so much for that. What are you staring at? I just liked it. Oh. So what's going on, guys? Yo, Kyle, what are you hmm for? Are you scheming? Are you scheming? <laughs> what's up, Cam? Chris Lemus was also the one. Sup, yo, yo, guys. Today's been a good day. I got off for work so I can actually do Foxy Friday today. So that's awesome. Um, shout out to Gage from Exotic Gaming from taking my shift tonight at Kohl's. So, Cam, you're crazy, man. Crazy. Y'all hear that bird? Free bird. If anybody wants one. Free bird. I picked up the Black Panther movie, Black Panther figure today. I have the one from Civil War still. I, I didn't get the other one. JP Jumps, what's happening? Yo, there's We Deliver. How's it going, man? I think Josh and Iron Patriot are uh, missing the show so far, so. Cool collection. What's good, Jesse? How are you? Hey, everybody go subscribe to Jesse Joe right now. She's everybody supposed in to attendance. escape you right now. That's dangerous. T-Man said, get the other Black Panther. I need to get another updated one. I'll probably get it whenever maybe Walgreens has another sale or something. Before Iron runs his mouth, I was here first. That's true, man. You were here first. It's very, very true. Yo, guys, so I have a few things today that I'm going to I'm gonna unbox. Yo, Rabbit Hammer. What's up, my man? Yo, Pickett the Handsome Collector said Toys R Us with a sad face. I know, man, it's an end of an era, but it was great while it lasted. I had some good mem memories from that store, so I'm just sad to see it go. <clears throat> so, yeah, guys, I have a few things that I picked up. Um, as you guys saw my last hunt video, if you guys watched that, I got this one, DJ. I got Lando, as you can see. Really cool character, a cool thing. Well, it's not Lionel Richie, Brooklyn. Like and I also got that awesome Ray with that. I think this is the face scan one. Correct me if I'm wrong. But I got this one as well. And I got this all for $16 and like 96 cents. So awesome pickups. Got these at Walmart. So check your Walmarts because some of the new waves are coming out in stores. And they're still having the $5 peg. So check that out. You'll definitely find the new Panther on clearance at some point. Stores are packed. Yeah, I think that's going to be the same with the uh, Infinity War wave. Um, right now they're scarce just like Black Panther wave was, but now every store you go to, Black Panther wave is abundant. It's crazy. Keyshawn, what's up? Feliciano, how's it going, man? And let's see, hitting Toys R Us, Walmart, and Target tomorrow. Yeah, I think Monday, me and Brooklyn may or may not hit up our Toys R Us for the very last time. I mean, it just depends. We Our store hasn't got any news yet, but I'm sure sooner or later all the stores will. William Christmas, hi from Ohio. What's going on, man? I was just in Ohio recently whenever we went to the toy department. Have I found the Infinity War 2 pack? No. I know Josh got his in today, and he sent me a picture, or sent a picture, and it looked fantastic. So, um, I wasn't even, I wasn't even online whenever that thing went up. So I did a thing, and Cody, you don't have to look for Taskmaster, you got me. What are you talking about, Al? What are you talking about? What's up from North Carolina? What's up, North Carolina? Uh, we've been there before, um, have we? Or is that South Carolina? I'm pretty sure we went to North Carolina. Todd, my man, you still still got that wrench, I see. Finally going up a black hole, and that is Marvel Legends. Yo, I highly suggest Marvel Legends. I do. I uh, I didn't get into them until around the Sandman wave. I had some of the toy biz as a kid, but around the Sandman wave, I finally got into them, and I'm glad I did. They take up a lot of my shelves, I'm not going to lie. But speaking of legends, I did pick up this guy. You guys will be seeing this hunt probably on Tuesday or maybe Monday. We'll see. It might be Monday or Tuesday, depending on how much editing I can get done, because I do have to work this weekend. And I also got this guy, well, these guys, uh, at Walmart. So I got this for nine dollars. 
at Walmart on clearance. It showed 19 on the tag, um, but it was actually $9. I posted a receipt on Instagram of what all my haul was, so make sure you're checking that out. I built Thanos and got an extra one I'm sending your way. Yo, we deliver it. I appreciate that. What do you want for it? What's goody salute from Houston? What's goody salute from Houston? That was a tongue twister. I don't know why I said that. What's up, Sid? I'm miffed right now. I waited Wednesday for Josh's live stream and it never came. And I remember seeing the hunt vid. He's saying he's pulling back on the live stream. And then you cried. I know, man. Uh, he, the dude needs a break. He's been grinding live streams for a while now. And two a week, I can only imagine. This one, I, I can only hype this one up so much on every Friday. <laughs> Is Josh here? I don't know. He said, Houston, LOL. Houston, we have a problem. And uh, it's my speech tonight. So let's, uh, what do you guys want to see? Actually, I forgot I had packages to open too. And both the people are in here right now. I got a package from Todd Taylor, which I am excited about this. This is uh, Chancho5000 in the comments below. All about to the mighty fox or else. What logo is on your hat? This is a Punisher hat. I need to get a new one. This one's this one's about busted. Um, I need to get something else. I need to get some Foxy for real hats. That would be awesome. But I looked into that before, and that is super expensive. But maybe if I mass produce them some way, somehow. Where the hell? I don't know. Where is Iron Patreon, Josh? That is... I know they got the notifications on. They better. Or we can't be friends anymore. Yeah, I want to know, since mine looks clear on my screen, how does the like, quality look on this right now? Is that right? Because I feel like this light up here is helping quite a bit. More than usual. <clears throat> Yo, and I also got this right here. That's not bad. I wish I had like a monitor right here so I could like, like a big monitor. You could block my face. Walmart here in Clinton, Tennessee sucks. Man, I'm sorry about that. Anyway, hit up Oak Ridge, man. I've been hearing some good things about Oak Ridge. But I got this today. This is from KJ Marshall. He's actually in the chat. I think he's at work right now. So just in case he has to go back, I think I'm going to go ahead and open this one up. Like the damn video where Foxy is going to let his pet fox loose on you. I will. Don't mess. Don't mess with the fox. I actually need a knife, so I'll be right back. Mr. Incredible, what is up? I know, I heard that. So, have you guys checked out the Zero Fox Given shirts yet? These are available right now. Keyshawn Marshall, there he is. KJ, dude, I'm excited to open this. So, I don't know, maybe Josh isn't going to hop in tonight. Bill Thomas is, though. What's up, Bill? All right. Yo, does it matter which side I open it from? Does it matter? Let me know. Because sometimes people like to say, put stuff on top. And I messed up one time. And I, I, I like to ask now. <laughs> Ratson, what's up, man? Jamie, Tom, what? So I'm going to go ahead and cut. I think, it's, I think it's okay to open any side. I'm going to go ahead and open this side. Top. Top, top, okay. He said, what did you just say? I said, I don't think Josh is going to make it tonight, and I was really sad about it. He said, I forgot, just go for it. What up, Foxy? I'm Artist Wolf from IG. Yo, what's up, man? Got some sick stories going on. Y'all need to check that out. Yo, Josh, what's good? Everybody say what's up to Josh. I see some goodies. I see some good stuff. Huh? Chocolate. Choc no, it's not chocolate. Josh is in Brooklyn chocolate. Apparently that's what she wants. <clears throat> oh man, I see I see two. I see two good things. Yo, shout out to Jose Sanchez. Alright, so which one is this? It's upside down, so let's find out. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh man. What? Look at that. We have not saw these in a long time. Yo. Keyshawn KJ. Yo, that build a figure is so sweet, honestly. It is so cool. I, I might have to do this one as well. Plus the characters being different. I really dig this and check out that trunks, man. 
yo guys, get, show some love to Keyshawn because he just sent this and this looks fantastic. <laughs> Alright, so there's actually something else in here as well and it looks like it goes along with. Oh snap. Okay, yo. Sealed. That is dope. And it has the pieces. That is sick. I am super... No, dude, thank you so much, Keyshawn. I appreciate that. And actually, you cheap son of a gun. I know, man, I'm cheap. I, I gotta get these, man. So yeah, these are these are really sweet. Keyshawn, thank you so much. And actually, there's a note in the box as well that I'm gonna check out. See, I'm glad I opened it from the, the side I did because I would have ripped this note, bro. Alright, here we go. So, to Cody, aka Foxy for real, I've been watching you lot your live streams and hunt videos for some time now. I just wanted to send you a little something to add to your collection. We share the same love for this line of figures. Hope you enjoy them and it puts one you one step closer to completing them. Keep up the great content and one more thing, stay Foxy. Yo, man, I appreciate this so much. These two figures are awesome and them both being sealed makes it even better. This trunks looks fantastic. That Zumasu head, though. Fantastic. That's insane. Thank you so much, dude. I really, really appreciate it. Yo, if you have, if you make videos of your own, go ahead and plug yourself down below, guys. Follow Keyshawn on Instagram or YouTube and just show him some love because that was awesome. So we've already unboxed a epic package 11 minutes in. So congrats to you. Josh Pence, let me know if the Norman on Matt's Iron Patriot hangs out for a while. Let's see. Really like this line of for the yeah. The boxes are sweet. If you leave, I'm gonna ban you. You'll be right back. I have to watch Josh's video real quick. Patriot ain't taking no shit today. All right. Let's see. I think we're caught up. Yo, hey, oh, toy tube. What is going on, man? Rabbit hammer in the house. Oh, thank you to the upcoming wedding. I know that is literally a month and a half away. Forty three days, I think, is what our registry said. So. Let's see. What's up, East Coast? What's up, Memphis? How's it going, dude? So, let's see. Tonight, I have this guy here, which I'm super, super excited about. As you guys know, I couldn't find it. Peep my next video on Tuesday to see how I found this. It's pretty sweet. Um, so, I have him. I have the two-pack Vulture and Spider-Man with that and I have these three here so which one do you guys want to see so let me know in the comments below I got DJ I got Lando and I got Ray so which one do you all want to check out still on the hunt for that Thanos everyone getting messed up tomorrow or what Foxy and Josh more to come with that story Let's see. He said, oh, we might have time to open all of them. We'll see. Yo, thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a like. Yeah, no kidding. If you guys are just now joining or have been in here for a few minutes, go ahead and hit that like button. Punch it in the face because we got to get these likes mixed up with our, evened up with our views. So let's do this. So yeah, guys, which one do you all want to see open first? So Josh says, thanks, but he meant Thanos. Missing a toy show here in Columbia. Yeah, I heard it was a really good one. Curb stomp that like button. I like that. I like that a lot. So I saw Ray, and I've really been wanting to open her up anyway. So I think I'm going to go ahead and open it up. Even, I mean, you guys could have said something, but, you know, this Ray, I've been, I've been dying to open up. I bought this on Sunday um, for a really good deal. Unbox your Barbies. Oh, don't be telling anybody about that. What are, you, what are you doing, man? Only if Josh unboxes his ever-growing collection of Olaf from Frozen will I unbox those Barbies. That Ray looks great, in my opinion. Yeah, that Ray looks dope. Bye, Foxy. Good video. Thank you for joining, man. Uh, take it easy. Have a good night. Ooh, the soft goods, though, on this. Fantastic. Alright, so real quick, without taking the accessories out and killing your all's ears, here is the lightsaber. 
And there's also her pistol. And then there is her staff. So. That's great, too. He goes for 40 and up. Still need him loose. Hey, what's up, Foxy? Big Ant. What's going on? What's up? Oh. So here is Ray, and she does have the soft goods cloak on. So she is really, really cool. Let's see. I don't know. The, the hood is super weird. Big, I guess you could say. But I think I just have it down and around her neck. But yeah, there she is with the cloak on. I'm going to be posing her with her lightsaber, of course. And pull this back so you can see underneath the cloak as well. So yeah, this is a really good looking figure. I like the texturing look on her jacket and everything. But the cloth, the soft goods, makes this figure worth five bucks when it really is 20. I did get this for five bucks, but I would have paid 20 for this for sure. Been hunting for the Marvel Legends Infinity War and Deadpool Wave also that Thanos and I can't find them anywhere. Frustrating. Yo, don't fret on the Infinity War. They're hot toys right now. But they will be around and they will be everywhere sooner or later. Just like the Black Panther Wave, nobody could find that. Nobody found it anywhere except for a handful of people. And then all of a sudden, they were around. Like, everywhere. You can't, you can't not go to a Walmart now and not find them. Foxy, I hate finding hot toys. And I know, man. Who who finds hot toys, hot toys, and leaves them for twenty one dollars? It's crazy. So uh, let's see. There's Ray again. Once again. that that head sculpt though looks fantastic, and she even has her hair, as you can tell. Stop focusing on my face. Focus on the figure. Really, really cool. Do you know if the Deadpool wave will hit Target or Walmart? I've been seeing people find it at Meyer and Walmart. Not so much Target yet. I do. I want that Deadpool wave, and I want. I do. I just. I have to have the lizard, build a figure wave. I think I'm gonna end up getting every single one of those. Um, it's just finding it is gonna be the hard part. I know targets are having them. Are, I know targets are stocking them, but we don't have a target that's not 50 miles away, so it's hard to get up to Target. I'm sure sometime Walmart. Yeah, it hasn't hit Tampa yet. Wasted 1k in gas last month trying to save a few bucks for Thanos. Little did I know he was Walmart exclusive. <laughs> Oh, stop bugging, David. Stop bugging. Oh, man. Hasbro did good with the new head tech for Black Series, in my opinion. Greetings all from myself and Stella, who's awake. What? Everybody, say what's up to Stella. Shout out to her for being awake right now. Stella, you are the real MVP. Uh, just check out this cool raid that I got. I mean, I'm sure you can appreciate that. Check her out. So, Stella, thank you for staying awake just for my live stream. I really do appreciate that. And this Ray looks lonely without her lightsaber, so. Even looked under the target shelves for Thanos, and guess what you found? I'm gonna say some kind of midget. A midget, I knew it. Yo, what's up, man? Nah, I still can't pronounce your name, but Noogie? What's up? Meyer's supposed to restock the Sasquatch wave next week. Dope. Since I moved to Tennessee, I really miss Meyer. Yeah, Tennessee, um, we don't have anything. <laughs> we do, but I would love to have a Meyer. Meyer's, I think Meyer's fantastic. We've been into a few Meyers. Uh, we went on one the first time we went up, and then we went in a few with Josh, and I would love to have a Meyer, honestly. Let's see. What's about, what about the comments? Here we go. This looks good. Yeah, that's better. There she is with her lightsaber. I hope that did a little bit more justice for this figure, guys. This thing is so sweet. Awesome, awesome figure. Better yet, midget strippers. Oh my gosh. Oh, I nailed it. Awesome. So it's I got it now. Where's my hero Brooklyn? Brooklyn Smash. Where's where are you at? You can say hi at least. Hi. There she is. Toys aren't us is going, going, gosh. <laughs> Oh man, okay, so there is Ray. I finally unboxed her. I've been waiting forever now to unbox her. Ever I've been waiting for this live stream. You know how hard it is, guys, to buy a figure and then wait for a live stream? It's the most difficult thing in the world. I understand why Josh started doing Wednesdays and Saturdays because on Sundays when he bought a figure and he just did a live stream, I feel like we're crooked. Are we crooked? We're a little crooked. So now I understand that. Sorry if I'm moving the camera too much, guys, but it's got to be perfect. 
how is the hilt durable or feel cheap uh it don't feel too cheap but it don't really have much bend to it but i don't want to stress it so i think it's pretty cool i think i think it's pretty good <clears throat> i don't you know i mean as long as you're just sitting it on the shelf for a little while i think it'll be okay but as for messing with it too much it might cause a little bit of distress on there yo jeff.com what is up man how is the giveaway going any definite closing date for Toys R Us stores? I know Canada and Japan or Asia stores are, are fine. It's just the United States stores, apparently, and maybe some other countries. Let's talk about that. Mike, July 31st is what Iron Patriot is saying. All right, so I'm going to put her down real quick. And something I'm super excited for, we're going to go ahead and open this bad boy up. Old tea hands. So sad. My last ever Toys R Us online order, Vision and Scarlet Witch. All the pre-orders canceled by them. Hmm. Yeah, I never, I didn't get that one. I didn't even know that it was available online, to be honest with you. I was at work, I believe. You already announced the winner last night? Bro, I did not, I did not see that. I'm assuming I did not win. Can we call it Thanos? Never again can we call it Thanos. Josh, I'm sorry. What's going to happen with the TRU exclusives? I know Funko did an AMA on their Twitter, and they said that their exclusives, they haven't decided yet where they're going to go to. T-Han sounds too much like... Yeah, okay. So Thanos <laughs> is a really cool-looking figure, and... <laughs> can be yes, all stores closing except for overseas markets. Oh, man. He's probably laughing, right? <laughs> as soon as I said that, he threw up those. What, is this like freaking duct tape? Why isn't this cutting? Huh? Yeah. Come on now. I got the most dull knife in history. What's up, baby? I'm still waiting for my Sending Arm Morty. Yo, that's the only Rick and Morty chase that I don't have. I collect the Rick and Morty chases. I just I don't want to get into the Rick and Morty line because it's becoming beginning to be like Batman and Star and Star Wars, and there's a freaking pop for everything Rick and Morty. So I did not buy into that line, but I do like the chases, the chase variants like Meek Seeks. I have him and Weaponized Rick. I have him. I just want that Sentinel arm as well. So, ooh, he is dope. I don't really particularly care for this mining head. I don't know why. RIP headphones users. But yeah, check. It. Oh, it's so cool. It's so cool. I'm happy. I, I'm happy. This was worth the three weeks that my Walmart said they, they didn't have it. So here is Thanos. Not T hands, it's Thanos. And here is the Infinity Gauntlet. Maybe. There we go. Mm, look at that. Dope. No one wants those lame pops. <laughs> That's what Iron Patriot just said. So does this come off too? I don't think it's really supposed to, but yeah, it does pop off. And of course, I got that dreaded ab crunch where he's going to be moving around on me, but that's all right. Pop this back in there. Let's go back to the comments. Missing your live feeds, brother, but chilling and watching your reviews. Yeah, if you guys haven't checked out Josh's reviews, I don't know what you're doing. Um, Cause his reviews are fire. Like, I told him when he first did it um, that I do. I don't watch a lot of reviews. And if I like a fight, uh, if I like a figure, I will buy it. Um, but Josh's review on that Nightmare Batman made me want to watch more reviews from him. So encourage him to do more reviews because that was fantastic. He said, Josh, where are you at, dude? No, no. Who's, who's that? Who's that? Josh's comment. Even though my pops are not valuable per the expert Jetta Patrol. IP with authority. I would not pay 500 for your pops pence. Jetta Patrol, where are you at, dude? Says Iron Patriot. I don't know who Jetta Patrol is. Paul, I'm only asking 450, damn it. He's lurking in the chat. Come chat, catch these hands. Anyway, guys, here we go. Thanos, dope figure. 
So. <laughs> okay, anyway. And he also comes with this extra hand sculpt that you can take. Come on now. So here's his extra hand sculpt for his right, no, that's the left hand. So that'd be the other hand sculpt that does not have the Infinity Gauntlet, which I'm not sure why you'd want to pose it like that because the Infinity Gauntlet is dope. So, but that's, there's that. And then, and then here is the other head sculpt. Let me get my extra hand. I think I'm gonna put this one on there just because he looks menacing, like way better, I feel like, than the smile. Looks like a monkey. So he does not look like a monkey. Okay, he does look like a monkey, but still. <laughs> yeah. Duh, it's fucking new Skywalker. Oh my god. Uh, fucking do it, man. More reviews. No, okay, we are not focused. I can see it. What is going on? Let me get in the camera's face. <laughs> there we go. You will be chachon. My local Toys R Us is next to Barnes Noble. I always thought a bookstore would go before a toy store. Man, people read every day, though. People play with toys every day. Josh, your review was good. Nice. What? Your reviews gave me cancer. Oh, my God. I'm giving that Thanos a hard pass. I'm using Marvel Select Thanos. Yeah, that Marvel Select Thanos is really good. Um, before I was collecting Legends and Selects, um, I saw the Thanos with Lady Death at a Books A Million for, like, $14 clearance. And I was like, oh, that's really cool. And Joey was going to buy it. But... We didn't. We passed up on it because, of course, we were strictly pop collectors. Um, and now I've branched out to a lot of different lines. So it was a good cancer, he said. <laughs> so, yeah, I think I like this head sculpt better. I don't know about you guys. Which one's your favorite head sculpt? The one with the smiling face or the one with the just pissed off looking face? Why do you not want to? There we go. Anyway. I got to do it like that. The mad face. Big Ant. I do agree with that. Okay, guys. So, there was 30, there was 41 people in here whenever I just, I just thought about this. Um, and now there's 38, but 37. Okay, that's cool. So, I'm going to announce something that's going to be uploading tomorrow morning, Saturday morning. Every Saturday or Sunday morning, I will upload a video like this. Um, the name of the video is going to be called Good Figgin' Morning, and it's going to be a morning talk show kind of deal to where I talk anything figs. Um, I talk figs, fig news. Um, I talk about um, what's going on in our community, stuff that's coming out, stuff like that. Um, pretty much me giving you insights on my favorite figures, what I suggest that you buy, um, and really just anything figure related news. And hopefully sooner or later I can do special guests like Iron Patriot just said. So, with that being said, the first Good Fig in Morning it will be airing tomorrow morning, hopefully around 7 or 8 o'clock. And I'm going to do this just to kind of give you guys an extra little positive step in your day every weekend. So, hopefully at one point I can go back and do this every day. That would be dope. But until then, it's going to be every weekend. Good Fig in Morning. So, yeah. And yes, Iron Patriot, yes. So, yeah, I hope you guys are excited for that because I am very excited for it. It was super fun doing it, uh, actually talking, researching things that are coming out, things that have already been released in the news, but just kind of recapping your day. And the cool thing is, is that I want to discuss with you guys in the comments. So, like, every other video, when you comment on this video, next week I will be discussing your all's comments in the video as well. So, yeah. That was a long-winded spiel. I need a drink now. So what do you guys think about that? Are you guys excited for it? I see Josh is. I am very, very excited for it. It was really fun to, to do. Toys R Us closing. Don't know if you heard a million times. I didn't know that, Paul. I didn't know they were closing. Totally came. Yeah, I actually made a new logo for it. So you guys will see the first logo... Uh, you guys will see it for the first time tomorrow morning. So, uh, I think this this episode was very news related, just because I wanted to get it 
out there. Um, but the episodes after that are going to be strictly like some news with with discussions from you guys in the previous videos comments. So I'm really happy about that. So if I don't message you or comment back on your comment, it's because I have a reply for the next video of your comment. So. I'll DVR it. I'll, I'll let Stella tell me about it. Yo, Stella is more than welcome to join the conversation. So, um, yeah, guys, just join the conversation and make sure you comment on that video because we're going to be conversating. And I want you guys to kind of intermingle, I guess you could say, in the comments as well. So if you guys want to have a huge discussion in the comments, Josh, uh, stop. Oh, man. If you guys want to have a conversation in the comments of that video, I would appreciate that as well. So. And I might even showcase collections and stuff like that on there. So if you guys want your your collections showcased on a video of mine on Good Fig and Morning, maybe we'll do the collection of the week at the end of the video. Just some ideas throwing out there. I hope you guys are as excited as I am because it is going to be fantastic. Can I have a live segment with you and Stella? That is up to Thor. That yo Thor, we gotta. I want. We're gonna have to have like an interview with Stella. Why do you sleep sometimes on my live streams? Josh is a beautiful butterfly. Yes, yes he is. Let's see. Uh, what am I going to open now? I have a few things to open still. I think I'm going to do one of these guys, maybe. What do you guys think? This? One of these two? Or... I got trash everywhere. Where do you go? There he is. Or this guy. He said Thanos. Dude, I just... Were you not paying attention, bruh? I just opened Thanos. <clears throat> Open DJ and burn him. That's funny. <laughs> All right, <coughs> Foxy. Yo, Todd. Todd, wait, wait, wait. I forgot. <laughs> when the hell did you open that? Just a few minutes ago, bro. Stop drinking that past PBR. You'd be knowing that. The episode of Foxy and Cell in the Morning is brought to you by NyQuil. There we go. All right, Todd. So I know what this is, and I'm pretty sure I do. Um, and I'm pretty sure I just unboxed it, but that's okay because I... Okay. Yes, okay, here we go. From Todd's collection right here. Let's snap him back in there. Goku loose. So now I can actually start... I thought that was moving. Kishan just hooked it up with this and Todd just hooked it up with this so now I can keep this guy right here solid in the package while displaying him at the same time so Todd thank you so much for this I knew you were sending the piece I just did not know I don't think I did about the Goku so you are the man dude thank you so much I can't wait to pose this guy up now all right guys I'm gonna go post him I'll see y'all later Totally kidding. That's a nice necklace you got on Foxy. Thank you. This is actually from Feliciano. I've actually wore this every day since he sent it. So, yeah. I think it's brought me good luck. So, as you can see, I found some pretty good stuff. And I found almost all the figures in the new wave of Infinity War. Uh, which isn't that much of a feat. But, it, it, I mean, it will be soon. But, still. But, thank you, Todd. Thank you so much, man. I'm going to pose this up as soon as I get off this stream. Let's see. It is the chief. That is the chief. You can actually see that too. Wow. I'm still, every time I look down, I see this Ray figure and I just get blown away every time. Like, this thing is fantastic. Welcome, dude. Two is always better than one, and the Goku is a bonus with Shinron pieces. Yeah, man, thank you. That one is going to go on my shelf. This one. Just looks too cool to unbox and have two. So I'm just, this is so cool. So I can't wait to, I will send you a picture as soon as I get this one unboxed. And I will actually, I think I'll be completing Shenron, maybe? I think so. Yeah, should be. I should be completing Shenron, right? Maybe. No, I still need black haired Vegeta. I still need that one. Can someone? Oh my God! Oh, best wave so far is the Deadpool wave, and the best build figure is clearly the Lizard, in my opinion. Um, the Deadpool wave is sweet. I do agree with that. But the only really big wave so far that has ever wanted me to 
collect every single character in the wave has been the lizard build a figure wave. I want every single figure in that wave. Buy 573 hot toys and spend two thousand dollars on a pop patriot. That's exactly how you do it. I did not know you knew the form formula, Paul. Anyone little help? Oh, okay, thanks, Paul. All right, I'm just super stoked a lot of you. I super stoked a lot, and you got it. Paladin notwithstanding. Yeah, that's the only one I found in the Deadpool wave. And if you guys saw my videos, that's a good figure. Um, fantastic figure, but... Hmm. Are any of y'all wearing green today? Is it St. Patrick's Day? No. Well, tomorrow. tomorrow is St. Patrick's Day, so I guess I might have to do that. Except I don't think I own any green. I own a lot of these t-shirts, so if you guys want one, the link is going to be in the description below of all my videos. Just make sure you're checking out Teespring. Um, good night, Chancho. Um, later. Have a good night, you all. Later, Cody C on the flip, and stay foxy. Thank you, man. Thank you so much, much for the Goku figure. I'm super hyped about that. Thank you for watching, bro. Always, always supporting. Your short isn't green. What? <laughs> Nick's figs. I gotta save beer for tomorrow. Looking for that Irish midget with the gold. Oh my gosh. You just wear those two turtles behind you. I could, man. That would be. I should get like a little baby carrier and like put one in there and just carry him around have like a blanket covering him in public and like whenever somebody wants to see the baby just be like peeking it's a turtle we should do that <laughs> just wear those two turtles behind you yeah i should totally made a foxy for real like yeah, shamrock i thought you were supposed to forget i was i forgot yeah let's yeah. forget that's big money right there. That is that is big money. You are right, Nick. 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 You are right. All right, so I'm going to open this two pack, I think. Because honestly, with the other two Star Wars figures, I'm running out of room for Star, War Star, War Star Wars. And I can't talk today, guys. Um, I'm running out of room for Star Wars. And I think I might keep those in the box for a little while. Where did that knife go? So I found this for $9 at a Walmart near us. And the other Walmart, the local Walmart, has it for $30. So we went to another Walmart that said they had Thanos and I found it for $9. So it was a huge score. That'll be on my next video. I'll make sure you guys are checking that out. Always have a room for Star Wars. I'm going to take a video if I see him tomorrow, guys. I promise last time this, this will embarrass me again. Midget lives don't matter. When is there going to be a collector spotlight featuring Foxy for real? Oh, man. I don't I don't know. I've only talked to Brock a few times. He's a really good dude. I haven't really talked to him much, but he's a, he is a good dude. You see, Cody, when one, when one runs out of room for Star Wars figures, one makes more room. Yeah, I know. I do have a little bit of room. It's just I don't like to cluster up my figures. Like, I don't like to. I don't know. I just like to pose them separately, I guess. It's weird. I feel like I'm really late on this two-pack. Josh did a great job as the Plastic Addict. I'll ask that hype beast if you and Brooklyn can go on. Oh, that would be better. Hi. Oh, Nathan's in the house? What's up, Nathan Simmons? Josh says, yeah, I don't cluster up my, my figures either. He just sells his pops to make more room. Which is not a bad idea. That's actually what I did recently. So, all right, headphone users, beware! One more time. Here we go. Man, this one is like you can smell that plastic. Who said that? Just to clarify, are you going to C2E2? Yes, and you can thank Nate Simmons for that. So once again, Nate, I can't thank you enough. Thank you so much. Be gone, Pops. What's going good, everyone? I have 60 plus Black Series figs, so room is a problem. Yo, Mike, I hear that. But here is Ultimate Spider-Man. I heard a lot of people said that his joints were really stiff, but this one seems to be pretty good, actually, so... I break him as I say that. I'm kidding. So yeah, here is Ultimate Spider-Man, and I will unbox Ultra here in a few seconds. I love Spider-Man Legends, guys. I don't know what it is about them, but they just look so good. So there he is, once again. Looking really, really good. Can't wait to pose him up. 
I don't know how I'm going to do this because I have, as you guys know, I have a Spider-Man shelf and it's all posed up now. And I already have the movie Vulture on there, so I don't know how I'm going to, I'll figure it out, but I don't know how I'm going to pose Vulture on there. So, he's going to give away next week if he gets to new subs in the next five minutes. Who are you talking about, Iron Patriot? <laughs> That's the smell of plastic crack. Yeah, man, it is, and it is very, very addicting. So, glad you guys are my supporters and you guys understand this. But these look dope. We'll figure it out though. So let's uh, let's take this vulture out of the box. Now is this a helmet or a head sculpt? It's a head sculpt. Okay. Nate, thank you for helping one of my best friends make the trip of a lifetime with me and others. Wish you could make it. Yeah, no kidding. I wish Nate really could. That would be awesome. That'd be the icing on the cake. And no Iron Patriot. There's not going to be cake. So don't get excited. So there is Lex Luthor without his wings. I'm kidding. This is totally, <laughs> this is totally Vulture. Don't. Do you want him? Huh? Like, or, or you just want Spidey? I wanted both of them. Did you? Yeah. Oh. Why? Because I'm saying throw it in that pile. Oh my god. <laughs> I told you. That might not be a bad idea. Sub to Nathan's channel. You heard that squeak? What squeak? Do you have any of the Royal Subjects DVD line? I do not, Keyshawn. I do not. That's a really cool Spidey. I really like that masked head with that single carded version. Yeah, his. So let's put the wings on him real quick. Be right back. All right, homie. I thought I broke it. It was just the plastic. How about time? Okay, man. Sounds good. Love when you walk into a comic shop and smell the paper and ink. I love when to, I would love to just walk into a comic shop, man. Like a good one around here. There's not a good comic shop around here at all. We need one bad. Oh, I gotta take this off, don't I? Hmm. Hey, Foxy, how's, how's my... You want him? Do you want the bird? If you're checking up on him and you want the bird, I will ship him for free. Like, seriously. I'll pay your mom. Him. all right so i'm gonna do this later but yeah i'll take a picture of him and uh put this on my instagram later everything that i opened so be sure to check my instagram at foxy for real i'll put his wings on there then uh because i don't want to waste the time on this live stream when i get to be talking to you guys so Seriously, you take it. who what you take it. you'll you'll tap we will have to work out a deal if you're being serious I don't have a comic shop in town either. What's the bird's name? Literally, he's so freaking annoying that you can't call him by his real name. We just call him Bird. And it might be why he's such a bad bird, because he hates his name. What's his real name? Huh? His real name is Scratch, because he kept on scratching at the paper whenever he was little. <coughs> but it got to the point where Bird was really easier than... So, we are really... Uh, Really creative around here. He's a motherfucker. I'll take it. Yo. You'll be wanting a refund later, bro. Trust me. I'll ship it tomorrow. I'll take a lunch break. Come to the house. Oh, my God. That's why you need a fox. Yo, man, Kenobi. You're very adamant about getting a fox. I mean, have, look up having uh, foxes on, as pets on YouTube. Like, they say that they are super hard to, like, they want to burrow into your furniture. It kind of looks like the bird. <laughs> so there we go. There is Vulture. No. No. Come on. Come on. There we go. So there's Vulture with his helmet. Um, really, really cool head sculpt. I dig this one, actually. That looks really good. J-Work, did I ever get the 10-inch uh, Hulk? Actually, we found that at a bargain hunt around Christmas time. And I gave it to my best or one of my best friend Joey's little brother, Brandon. And, uh, yeah. Gave it to him for Christmas. You think there was only crack houses, but it's pretty normal suburban. <laughs> Have a red-footed female tortoise that's looking for a home. Yo, Iron Patriot, there you go, man. Oh, 
Let's see. No IP. IP's turtle's always running away. Maybe if he actually put it on a leash whenever he went outside to use the bathroom, he would actually not run away. <clears throat> I don't know. These things really actually really cool. This figure. I guess I just like the head, like the detail. Or a tracker. Yeah, put a tracker on that turtle. Tracker with glass mode. Yo, I am Patreon. If you are serious and you didn't see when I unboxed this, here you go. I thought you had it. So his ran away while I was at work. His name is Slowpoke. Slowpoke the turtle. That's funny though. A turtle running away. <laughs> oh man, I you know what? I really can't wait when we're in Chicago and we meet David for the first time. That's gonna be hilarious. That dude is all is freaking insane like his humor is off the charts yo paul i love t hands as well but josh doesn't like the name t hands <laughs> give him a hug for me foxy i will i will how can you run away if his name is Slowpoke? poke Satch pop what is up man how are you doing you're killing the game that's what you're doing what about the red hair goku pop did you get that one yeah i have that one i actually had two at one point <clears throat> i traded one away though so there we go. I'm going to figure out how to pose him up later and where to pose him. I'm probably going to put him with my uh, Avengers and stuff like that. After that trailer, I might put him with uh, Cap, honestly. But when will Foxy complete the Turtles? Man, I don't know. I want to so bad. Right now, we don't really have the room, but I want to. Is the Thanos the same as the Build-A-Figure version? I think there's a few different tweaks to him. Guys, correct me if I'm wrong. Like a, a repaint or something like that. Um, Iron Patriot said, yes, just a repaint. So yeah, he is pretty much the same thing. What did I think of the trailer? I got pumped at the trailer. And if you guys have not saw the Infinity War trailer, um, what is wrong with you? If, at first off, um, focus on my face. There we go. And um, yeah. I love the trailer. I cannot wait for it. I can't wait to see more. I hope they show more of Bucky because Bucky's one of my favorite characters. Um, yeah, go do that now. If you Go watch that trailer on a separate device other than this one so that you don't click off of this video. But the trailer is like shaking hands with Jesus. That's probably the best way to put it. Um, and not my friend Jesus either. The actual Jesus. That's like that. Yes, the scene with Cap and Thanos where he... Mm, so, so cool. Does anybody get the uh, Marvel Legends Infinity Gauntlet yet? I have the Marvel Legends Cap Shield, but that Infinity Gauntlet is calling my name. Where are you going to put it? I'll wear it. What do you mean where am I going to put it? I'll wear it every day. Oh my god, whatever. Do Dog did it for 80 at Best Buy. Why did Josh say no? He said no. Why did, what was that? He said it's trash. It's just a prop, though. Man, it was articulated. That's what an Iron Patriot said. It's not trash. Folks are making such a... Oh, welcome back, Nate. I haven't seen it here yet. It looks like... I want to see it out of the box. I hope my game snap opens it up. They usually do with all their stuff, so... If you got the gauntlet, would you wear it to the wedding? Would I? No. Of course. Since he returned his, oh snap! They have one at my Walmart. Hot Toys is all, yeah, I saw Hot Toys is coming out with one, but it's like eight hundred and ninety six dollars or something like that. Insane. Well, if you want to get the Hot Toys one, I th I think it's more than three hundred. I thought it was like eight. I heard it was expensive. I could be wrong. I probably am, but I heard it was super expensive. Thought about it, but Mezco PX Wolverine is coming out soon, and I want that. Yeah, I need more Mezco in my life, guys. I really do. So I think I'm going to do this for an hour. So we got 11 minutes. So let's uh, let's chat, guys. What's going on in your all's life? Yeah, C2E2. Let's talk about that. Has anybody been to C2E2? Um, what are your thoughts on it? Yo, did somebody say Cincy Nerd? Cincy Nerd's in the house? Yo, Cincy, what is up? Yeah, you are just a little too late. I'm kidding. We're going to run for about 11 more minutes. Um, he said, Cincy, why did you return to Gauntlet? Honest opinion. There we go, Cincy. What is your opinion on that gauntlet? 
Josh, it is really trash. I just wanted to know your opinion because I kind of wanted to get it. What's up, Syndicate? Ah, I see what you did there, Michael. I see what you did. Yeah, since he's the only really thing you missed. Hey, Zeus Vigons, what's up? Is I got T-Hands, a.k.a. Thanos. So, I uh, got him. Um, what else did we get? I opened up this two-pack right here of Spidey and Vulture that I finally got. Um, for $9 at Walmart. And, let's see, let's see, let's see. I got this Dragon Stars figure. I got this Dragon Stars figure. I got this Dragon Stars figure that I'm going to open up and put on my shelf. And the one that I can't stop staring at, Ray. So, love this Ray. I think maybe 40 to 50 on it, but 88 seems a little bit too much. Focus on my face. Thank you. Hey, I looked everywhere for the black hair Vegeta, but he is super scarce in this area. Yo, I think he's just super scarce everywhere, man. He's I can't find him anywhere either. I agree with Josh. Marcella, what's up? No, nah, man, didn't pick it up. Nope, never did open it. Wow. IP spend the 88 on beers for your boys, Foxy's and me. Yo, IP already owes me, like, what, two beers and a few shots after this morning? Any NECA in your collection besides the Turtles? Yeah, I actually have a bunch of NECA Predators. I mean, I actually did a whole video of just my NECA Predators and posing them up. I just got the Jason Friday the 13th NECA as well, and... Yeah, I could have swore I had some more stuff. That might be it for now. But I'll let you know if there's any more. But I think that's it. But I have a lot of the Predators. I have tons of the Predators. I did pick up Proxima Midnight. Yo, Proxima does look pretty sick. I saw her at a Walgreens and I was budget hunting, as you guys know. I'm doing that for C2E2. Um, and it looks pretty sick. David Patrick, how's it going, my dude? I'm trying to find the re-release on Ultimate Leatherface. That does look cool. So mom said, come get the bird and promote him on air. He can be in your next Fox box. Yeah, we can give it away. Yo, that's, you guys really have never saw the bird, have you? We need to go get it. You guys can actually see what the noise is in my video. Yo, Kenobi, yes, it is. She supports, she supports. Did Mesco Sovereign go up for a pre-order yet? Hi, Foxy Moms. No. Yeah, Josh did see it in person. And Josh was, fell in love with him, but he couldn't take him at the time. But Josh, you can have him now. They said, show us the bird. Thor said, I got dibs and barbecue sauce. Let's go get the bird. I'm going to go get the bird. I'm going to go get the bird. You guys are going to finally see this bird. And I'm going to take an auction right now. So... I'll start the bidding at 10 cents. Yeah, dollar, Nate. Nate said a dollar? Thanks, Dylan, to him. So, Nate betted a dollar. Try not to die here. Yo, yo, here is the bird. This old scratch right there. Yeah, his wings aren't clipped, so he might fly around a little while. But check him out, guys. <laughs> no, he's going to be the star of this show right here. Talk. He, he talks sometimes. 25 C-Nets and a cheese sandwich. Yo, what are you guys, you guys going to bet on this or what? I got 30 cents. I think somebody already betted a dollar though. Sold me. There he goes. Where is my bird like Whiplash from Iron Man? Wow, my dad had that same bird, seriously. Yo, he's, he, he can be cool, but he's really noisy. Say what's up. I mean, he can't really talk, but he can say I'm a good bird. That's about it. 
Jesus, okay? You, I swear he's going to poop on me. You should take him with you on a, <laughs> with you. I bet, yeah, Nate bit it a dollar. Let him sit on your shoulder. No, I feel like he's going to go to the bathroom, and I do not want that on a live stream. Does he bite? If he gets pissed, yeah. So, but he's usually... He's usually pretty good. So. Or said you just gotta cover him up to calm him down. Not him. We cover him. So we got bids going on for this guy. So he knows his name, yeah. Hey, quit. He's going to cry. I know it. He's, it's just a matter of time. Can you get him to say back to you, Bob? My dog would eat him. Unfortunately, I have two Germans and a terrier. Yo, we have a pit and a um, Yorkie, and they don't really do anything. I love that the camera focused on him perfectly. All right, guys, I'm going to set him down and let him do his thing. So Thor said... So cute. Yeah, he's all right. He's okay. Bert is the... Yeah. If you really want to get rid of him, PM me seriously. Yo, Thor, we could make out a deal. It's not really my bird, though, so... I'm sure she wasn't. She wouldn't care. So, guys, let's talk figs for the last few minutes. Um, what is something you guys are looking for? And remember... So... Die. Remember that uh, a new kind of video is coming tomorrow morning... Good fig and morning. It's a morning talk show all about figs. So, uh, I hope you guys are excited for that because I am super excited for that. A thousand dollars pickup only. Trades welcome. You can hand what are you doing? To IP. Huh? You can hand deliver to IP. With I could, yeah. I'm going to hand deliver this guy to Iron Patriot. <laughs> That's E2E2. What are you doing? He's like going crazy. You finally finished my lizard build a figure. It's really nice. Great minds think alike, Cincy. Doing the nastiest thing. He said, Iron Patriot said my wife would love him. I eh. doubt it. You can get him to quiet down. Have the bird ride Iron Patriot's turtle. We could. All right, Cody, got to bounce. I'll see you later, man. And I can't wait for bids tomorrow's video. Yo, I can't wait to post it, man. Do not go up there. Still waiting for the Walgreens Mr. Fantastic to show up here. What kind of bird is he? He's a cockatiel, right? All right. Yeah, he's a cockatiel. He, since he said, I know a neighborhood cat that would love that bird. He's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, Memphis Dale, take it easy, man. We are about to hop off this live stream at, right at one hour, which we are at 57 minutes and 50 seconds. So um, remember, guys, tomorrow, good fig and morning. I'm super excited for you guys to see this. Um, so remember... Around 8 or 7 o'clock, I want to have this thing scheduled to upload. So I hope you guys are going to check out that. Going to check out that. Remember to join the conversation in the comments of that video too. Because I'll be, I will be answering them in the next Good Fig in the Morning. So. Do you put a cover on his cage? It's supposed to, yeah, we do. We do put a cover on his cage. It's just, he goes crazy. If you, if he hears, if you go into the bathroom, he goes crazy. If you, you look at him wrong, he goes crazy. You look at him wrong, he goes crazy. It's, it's, mm. peace brothers, night all. So yeah, guys, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed me unboxing these figures, uh, and you guys actually got to see the bird now, so that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Show him Thanos. Let's see, without him flying away. Can't no, fly. I can't reach it. <laughs> Ladris on them and Jay. Josh says bye. Yo, we got one minute and everyone's signing off. He wants running water from the bathroom sink, probably. Night Foxy in Brooklyn. See you guys. Um, what else can I plug? Shirts in the description, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Check out the video tomorrow and a video when I get um these two and Thanos, probably on Monday and Tuesday. So thank you guys so much for watching once again. You guys are amazing. Since he to 10K very soon, and he's giving away a hot toy. Yo, I'm going to hit 3K soon. We are almost at 2,700 subscribers. So we are going to hit 3K very soon. Hopefully by C2E2, because that would be really, really cool. Um, so thank you guys for subscribing. Thank you guys for your support. Thank you guys for your loving comments. I always like to talk to you guys. So 
Thank you so much for watching, and as always, stay foxy.